door Oh, you don't need them anymore I've got you now Hold on to me, don't let me go Oh, if you find it hard to breathe I'll show you how Great marriages don't happen by luck or by accident. They're the result of a consistent investment of time, thoughtfulness, forgiveness, affection, mutual respect, and a rock solid commitment between two people. Today we celebrate this. You two already seem to have this part covered. Choosing an intimate, adventurous wedding in another country shows that you don't need a big fancy celebration to prove your love to one another or to anyone else. As we strip away the performance of getting married in the traditional stressful setting, this becomes your special memory to share with some of your most favorite people. As we prepared for this ceremony, I asked you to reflect on what it is that you love most about each other, which was probably the easiest part of planning this whole elopement. Kate, Robbie admires your determination. You have huge life goals that you're striving for to better yourself. But then there are also the daily tasks that you seek to accomplish. The little things like housework and yard work, or giving her a back rub to make her day a little better, show that you already understand the importance of happy wife, happy life. She values your authenticity. You are yourself no matter what never changing to fit anyone's standards. You are genuine, transparent, and honest. Robbie knows that there are no secrets and she can trust you completely. And then of course, she loves how caring you. Those little acts of kindness like a quick text to check in on her do not go unnoticed. And watching you love Dash through the recovery process after surgery it was eye-opening for me. You kept him safe, calm, and healthy, and that fills her with hope for you as dad to her future kids. Robbie. Kate appreciates your kindness and compassion. He believes there couldn't be a person alive who could dislike you for any reason. He values your companionship. You support his crazy ideas and encourage him to be himself. Even though he can be a lot to handle, you're always his biggest fan. And finally, he finds you beautiful beyond words. You light up the room and every day with you is a gift. He's a big fan of pretty things, and you're about as pretty as it gets. A marriage, as most of us understand it, is a voluntary and full commitment. It is a sacred ceremony before God, entered into, the, in, entered into with the desire and the hope that it will continue to last the rest of our lives. From Romans 8.28 we know that all things work for the good of those who love God, who are called according to His purpose. Before you declare your vows to one another, I want to hear you confirm that it is indeed your intention to be married here today. Robbie and Kate, do you both come here freely and without reservation to give yourself to each other in marriage? If so, answer, I do.
call into the space between the clouds There's something beautiful in the quiet we have found Something beautiful Our feet can take us Heaven knows The world that we will find We'll paint the open sky Illuminate the night You and I You and I Right where we belong Robbie and Cade, from this moment forward, you'll never be alone. May God bless your lives together with prosperity and good health. May you always share open and honest communication with each other. May you respect each other's individual talents and give full support to each other's professional and personal pursuits. May you cherish your home as a sanctuary with Dash and Kitty and the children's laughter that will come to fill it. May all the years to come be filled with moments to celebrate your love. May your love be a lifelong source of excitement, adventure, affection, and respect for one another. And finally, may you live happily together every day as you are on this day. Now that you, Robbie, and you, Cade, have declared your love for each other through this exchange of vows and rings. It is my honor and delight to pronounce you husband and wife. What God has joined together, let no man separate. You may now kiss your bride. We belong.